I am living the good life today. Let me tell you, I drove all the way out to Winter Park to paddle the chain of lakes that are connected by canals. It is so beautiful. It lived up to the hype. Take a look at my favorite, the Venetian Canal. The Venetian Canal connects Lake Osceola and Lake Maitland. It can get busy, but in the early morning, I had it all to myself. Along the way, you'll pass lush greenery, quite a few boat garages, and catch glimpses of nice houses. The paddle took less than 10 minutes, but you'll likely want to stop and take photos of everything because it just feels magical here. So here's how this paddle came together. I set out from Tampa before 5 a.m. on a Saturday because you never know what you're gonna encounter on I-4 and I did not want to take any chances. I parked at Dinky Dock Park, yes, you heard that right, in Winter Park on Lake Virginia. The parking lot is pretty small, fills up fast, so another reason to get here early. There is a small boardwalk down to a small beach, but just a fair warning here, the boardwalk has a really tight turn, so it's a little tough to navigate if you're using wheels to transport your kayak. I set out just as the sun was rising and took a left to get to the Fern Canal that connects Lake Virginia to Lake Osceola. Off the bat, I encountered some fishermen blocking the canal, but I was able to squeeze through. There we go, we got it, we got it. <laughs> okay, have a good one. More on canal traffic in just a moment. I paddled north on Lake Osceola to get to the Venetian Canal that connects to Lake Maitland. There are so many beautiful homes to look at along the way, but just keep an eye out for buoys that indicate where the canal entrance is. There are scenic boat tours that take place on the Venetian Canal between 10 a.m. and 5 p.m. Have I mentioned that it's a good idea to get here early yet? Uh, this is another reminder, because take a look at what I saw a little bit later in the morning about around 9 a.m. One more tip here. Don't lose yourself too much in the moment while taking photos of the canal. I saw a snake hanging out right on the edge. I didn't get any pictures because that is not my jam. I will take gators over snakes any day. All right, to Lake Maitland now. It is a beauty and the water quality was really great. Plus, there are even more pretty houses to look at. Are you sensing a theme? You can even make a pit stop at Dog Island if you want to. Instead of doing that, I continued to what I thought would be a canal between Lake Maitland and Lake Minnehaha. I turned around halfway because it, well, uh, wasn't quite as charming as the others. The final canal I checked out was between Lake Virginia and Lake Mizell. It was really short, not super scenic, so I would save it for last if you have the time. I am wrapping things up, heading back to Dinky Dock Park. Again, I can't get over that name, 10 out of 10. This paddle was awesome, totally worth the 4.15 a.m. wake up. Let me know if you have plans to do this or if you've been out here before, comment below. And also, please subscribe to this channel to get ideas for other adventures around the Bay Area and beyond. Poor kayak. Oh, good news. Bathrooms are open now.